Pick. A couple more bottles and we'll all be passed out on the floor. Who cares? We're not on duty tomorrow. Let's live a little. Come on, drink up. Now, if we hadn't accepted her invitation, which is, um, you know, a pretty good chance because you might decide you don't want to talk with the Sith. Oh, I'm just noticing Fraps has some, for some reason dropped to 15 frames per second. I'll finish my conversation here and then just um, restart things. Um, you may not have wanted to talk to the Sith in the bar, so what do you do? How do you get in here and find this? Oh look, a disguise! Well, you can fight your way in here as well. So, and it's not dark side, you just have to off a bunch of people. And I, I seem to remember there's another way you can get in there as well. There's lots of different choices depending on your playstyle. And while we're here, we'll also take care of this take those and I'll do a quick save here and I will be right back you may not notice the gap when I figure out what's wrong with fraps and why it's only doing 15 frames a second okay we're back and fraps is happy or at least happy-ish and did we bypass no we haven't skipped an apartment let's go check the other apartments out in this area and actually, to be honest, the whole 15 frames a second thing with this game, it'd be pretty hard to notice. I could probably actually save some video size by going to 15 frames a second. Anyway, sorry, I'm rambling. Talking to myself, which I suppose, now that I think about it, that's what I've been doing for hours, isn't it? And... The reason I was worried we might get into fights, there are other rings of apartments, and some of them not so friendly. And I'll just walk up to the window here. Okay, that one's good to go. The, again, more generic people. If they don't have a name, there's not much reason to chat with them. Quick save. No problem. Got it. Please, please don't hurt me. You don't have to kill me. I'll have Davik's money if he if he just gives me a little more time. Please, I don't want to die. Here, I've got 50 credits on me. That's all I've got. It's yours. Just don't tell Davik where I'm hiding, okay? I'm begging you. What are you babbling about? Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. You mean, you're not here to kill me? But I, I thought you were one of Davik's bounty hunters. If you're not here to kill me, what do you want? Maybe I could help you with your problem with Davik. I don't think anyone can help me. I owe Davik money, and I was late with the payment. So he went to Zach's in the bounty office and put a price on my head. I've been hiding here ever since. But sooner or later, someone will find me. Unless I somehow come up with another 200 credits. I'm a dead man. Mm, and I don't think I have 200 credits, which is why he just says, don't worry, I won't tell anybody you're here. If I had 200 credits to spend, I could give it to him. So we might head off to a vendor to get that money. And trust me, you're, you're not going to be short for money, really. So you can be the ultra nice guy. Thank you. You've saved my life! At least until one of Davik's bounty hunters finds me. So that's sort of a quest. So I think we have enough stuff to spend that if I go back to any of the vendors, we can probably get that 200 credits. And I think I'll do that. So where's the closest vendor? We're here. This is South, which we know has vendors. Droids by Janus. I think any vendor will buy anything, so let's go and check her out. Yo, 
go, Janice. Hachu a punky. Let's see what you got for sale. Tangabunshan. Let me see your inventory. And show sell list. So this is all the stuff I can sell. Security spikes are probably worth keeping. Parts. Clothing. Mm, item value zero. Longsword. Fiber blade. Well, let's get rid of the longsword. I don't want to sell too many of my weapons because we will be getting more party members. But I certainly am not going to need so many. So let's just reduce things down to two. Uh, okay, we have enough credits for the guy, but that would leave us with one credit. So let's see if there's anything else we can sell. Actually, really, there isn't. Um, I'll keep my grenades around. We really don't need that many blaster pistols or that many short swords we can live without. I may have overdone it, but you know, this early in the game, we're going to be finding plenty of equipment and that sort of thing. So I'm, I'm not worried even if I'm going to need two short swords, for example. I'll just do without for a little while and I'm sure I'll find one. So now if we head straight back to the guy that was in the apartment, this time I'll have another discussion option. Now how would I know that if I hadn't played through? It puts a mention of it in your log that that guy is still in his apartment so you wouldn't forget. Actually uh, I'll try and quickly show you and see here Rat Ghoul car, Largo's bounty. A merchant named Largo owes a large sum of money to Davik. Because of this he is unable to pay the debt. Largo has gone into hiding. Davik has put an illegal bounty on his head. So there's probably a couple of ways we can solve that. Of course we could kill him and get the bounty but the easiest way is just pay up. Now how far around was the guy? No, that's just the family. the empty apartment. Another empty apartment. Another empty apartment? Uh-oh. And there he is. What... what do you want now? You're not going to tell Davik's bounty hunters where I'm hiding, are you? Maybe I could help you, so we're going to see if... Uh, I, hopefully he only wanted 250. Maybe I could help you out with your problem with Davik. I don't think anyone can help me. I've been hiding here. Here, I've got 200 credits like you can have. You'd give 200 credits to a stranger just to help them out? I don't believe it. Well, uh, thank you. Wow, that sure was generous of you. I just hope we don't end up needing those credits later on. Yeah, no now sweat. I can pay off Davik. Oh, thank you. You've saved my life. Oh, I better go give this to Davik right away. So, a journal entry, credits lost 200, experience 110, and another light side point. And he's also leaving his apartment, so I take that as permission to loot this box. And what the heck? Can always use another med pack. Okay. Actually, I'm about ready to take a break. What we'll be doing in the next video, or, well, I really don't know how these videos are going to cut together, to be honest, but what we'll be doing next, anyway, is I'll check my quest log to see if there's anything else outstanding, but probably donning that suit of armor and heading into the Undercity next. So, for me at least, this is a break, and we'll see you later.